Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Nilnar and once again in a new game. Today we're going to do Stalker 2, The Heart of Chernobyl. Chernobyl. Be, this will be coming out about a week after it was released. Um, just based on timing and everything. So hopefully you will enjoy this. I'm sure you've watched a little bit here and there. But let's see how my playthrough goes. Now I have everything set up on Epic uh, Visuals. I do have it set up so uh, we're in streamer mode so we'll be able to listen to music when there's music there. Uh, we'll, we'll take our uh, hopes that it's all good. Uh, graphics wise, like I said, I have everything set to epic. We're going to try that out and see how it goes. Uh, I may turn the uh, motion blur down but we'll, we'll leave it as is for now just to see what happens. So with that, let's get in. We'll watch the cutscene and we'll meet up afterwards. We will play stalker level, um, kind of story and uh, balanced combat. I'm not crazy enough to go to insane battles yet. We'll keep it middle of the road. Won't make it too easy though. You can track any location tag on your PDA. That's good to know. Hey, grabbed something there. Don't know what it was, but we grabbed it. Last question, Dr. Dalek. Are you sure the perimeter surrounding the zone is really enough? If a powerful emission were to occur, we... Listen. The zone has remained stable for years. Besides, we didn't establish the most advanced institution in human history without first guaranteeing its safety. As the head of the Scientific Institute for Research of the Chernobyl area, or Circa for short, I believe the wonders that we will bring to the world far outweigh the potential risks. How big are these risks exactly? <laughs> The zone reveals a whole new world. We can stick with the old one, fearing change. But tell me, do you want our descendants to remember us as cowards? Or as those who dared to venture forward to a new, better humanity? Remind our listeners that a similar incident happened in our region quite recently, ruining homes and livelihoods. <laughs> City officials urge people to stay calm, assuring them the situation is totally under control. Well, that was a wild ride. Are you alive back there? Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. The zone is really raging today. See that? It was a hell of a blast. Can't remember one. So fierce. Are we uh, close? Uh, kind of. Well, dangerous Central all that checkpoint going around. Could be on alert after the emission, but there's another way in. Crack in the wall to the left of the fault. Bugger off! 
hope you didn't lose your secret artifact along the way. If it was outside the zone for too long, it would have lost its anomalous energy. <clears throat> but I've got this shiny metal thing to recharge it. One lucky activation and we have a gold mine here. Sector 9, visual detection of the vault. I say again, Sector 9, visual detection of the vault. You gotta watch out for helicopters. Show me what you found. What the hell is this? I've seen artifacts taken from the zone before. They always burn out and fall apart real fast. But this one? This one is not from the zone. Oh, I bet. Where'd you find it? In my laundry basket. <laughs> Not happy with that. Who do you think you're talking to, huh? You have any idea what this scanner cost me? If you know it's what? not an artifact, it's gonna blow us all to hell! I won't let my hard work come to nothing because of you. I won't let you push it down the shit up. <laughs> this stone owes me a new home. We gotta move. I think I'd do what he says. Okay, going up on the Get to the car. scientist's bunker. Nehoda will explain how to proceed with the scanner. He's waiting for you. Good luck. Oh, thank you. Just leaving us on us on our own here. Oh, here we go. We're in. Give me Things a are looking good. Perimeter breached. Excessive damage caused by. Oh, fuck knows what. Copy that. Dispatching a response team. Oh, for light, huh? Okay, we got a light. We can run. I really don't want to walk through the water. See if there's a way over here around the water. Oh, nope. We're in the water now. Might as well just do it. It's only a little puddle. It's not as deep as I thought it was. Hey, we'll jump up here. Maybe. There we go. Med kits help uh, store help bandages keep us from bleeding. So we'll pick up this med kit. Uh, almost went right by it. Make sure I'm not missing anything else. Okay, tab gives us options. We got a knife and a pistol. We'll get the knife out. Okay, left click and right click. Gotcha. Generator works. What do I have here? Oh, we'll just pick it up. Looks like pick up and hold I think is use that item when you pick it up Can I use the knife to get rid of that yes that way I don't uh, 
Quay Sports. And light back on, it's a little dark. See the open kernel. Okay. Investigate the scientist's bunker. Notes. And of course, all the tutorial stuff we're learning. Okay. But we got to get to this spot here. Okay, let's not touch that. Ooh, this is nice. Let that come back down here and then we'll run through behind it. Oh, let's go, let's go. I will come back here. to come back we've got everything let's get out of there so I have check it and kit I use one of those heal up also having a quick bar. Whoop, I don't want to do that. What did I do? Bandage. I want to keep that there. I'll let that come back. I want to see what's down that passageway before we go. So this is the way we came, wasn't it? Yep, okay. So we could have went to it a couple different ways, but we're about ready to get out of this. Docker 3, we've got a breach at the new gun. The bunker's off, and now the ground team is on the way. South, I still don't have any maps. Stick to the perimeter. Avoid going in. I'll contact the sphere. So our, our compass will tell us where enemies are, where bodies are. The world is this ugly dude. Need a bandage up. Two of these, okay. So back in here. I 
hang on to it because it looks like they will wear down. I want to keep the ammo for this guy. Definitely looks interesting out here. Get a little more light on the situation. So we need to go back in our inventory. Do we have food? There we go. We need to find more food too. around around here I don't meet up with any more of those mutant frogs so what the only thing I can call it is a mutant frog nothing there let's check this house out leave anything when they ran out of here oh we do have something I'll pick that up for later a little sausage when we get peckish another bandage now I gotta figure out how to switch maybe I need to look at that options let's look at the keyboard controls real quick Quick saves, of course, uh, strap left, right, sprint, crouch, walk, lean left and right, fire, reload, change ammo types, hold breath, stealth, kills, okay, knife attacks, interact, jump off ladders, knife, grenade, bolt, detection, A detector, inventory, sword inventory. Oh, it just looks like we have slot one as Q, but how do you get to slot two? And try something. Uh, that's just my guns and stuff, okay. Um, I don't want to use Q because I don't want to use it, but I don't know how to use the other quickly. Let's see if there's a way upstairs, but I don't see an easy way of doing it. I want to break a leg. I don't know if he can or not, but it wouldn't surprise me. Got a light over here. I cut. Curiosity, hard to take off. Okay, that's better. I like quick. Now what was he shooting at? Is it gone? I need to go off that direction. There's a little radiation around here. Uh, trucks seen better days.
assuming that's already unloaded. Have you reached the bunker? Find Dr. Ngoda. He's agreed to give you the coordinates. I don't think it'll be that easy. But I'll figure it out. Okay, we're up at the bunker. But I don't think he made it. Whatever took him out, took him out quickly. I'm gonna check what's upstairs. Don't think there's a downstairs yet. Can't grab that med kit. Can't open that door, okay. Intriguing. Open this door? No. Shows that we should be able to. There we go. Just didn't come on to it right. Now hopefully nothing in there. What the fuck happened here? I hear anti-rad drugs. Oh, that's always good. We'll take all those. I want to check something else in the journal. Go here to the journal. Uh, no, that wasn't the journal. Journal. Here we go. Tutorials. Okay, Q, hold down to use the bandage. I gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Got everything off him, okay. So what are these? Scientific med kit? Nice. Now if we look at our journal, look at notes. A pro as project leader, I'm ordering to remain in the bunker until we receive the suits from the Institute. Safety comes first. Regardless of any psi radiation coefficients you may have detected, if you venture into the cave one more time, I'll kick you out personally. First out of the cave, and then out of this project. Soldier, got it. Dr. Nuhad, yes, it's all on my laptop. How long will these coordinates be up to date? Until next new mission, so that guy of yours should move his butt. There's someone at the bunker. There must be a man Herman sent. Okay, what do you have here? What is it? Any updates? The goat is dead. So are the other scientists. Dead? Oh, God. We're screwed. Get out of there immediately. Stop freaking out and tell me where the data is stored. Find his laptop. The coordinates should be in there. Let's see. We will take these and that. I'm going to go ahead and drop these off because I really don't need them now that I got them memorized or read. 
and it's just taking up inventory space that I could use for more guns or food or what do we get here? So that's actually a different weapon. Five five six where this uses a five four five. Nice. Okay. Well probably ought to go ahead and load this up. Let's see, we got echo detector. Water, that's nice. Some bandages and that. Okay. So again, we're gonna take it off for right now. That'll help us reveal artifacts nearby. Still have to go back here. We gotta find his computer still. There we go. Let's get the data. And it is copy. Hey, Nagoda. What's up? Have you met Herman's client yet? Tell him a new mission means new coordinates. New coordinates means a new bill. <laughs> of course. Nagoda's dead. I'm Mr. Client. Whoa! That's a hell of a mess you got there, boys. Well, screw that smart-ass bastard. I never liked him anyway. <laughs> Hold on a sec, Mr. Client. Did Herman at least tell you what to do with the coordinates? Remind me. Holy fucking cow. Will you let me eat in peace for once? All right. Follow the coordinates and stick your scanner into the ground. And then back off. When it's all done, you pick it up. Got it? If Very not, straightforward. that's your problem. I'm not a damn help desk. So long, Mr. Client. Oh, so long to you too, sir. Do you have the coordinates? I hope you do. Things are about to get a little more complicated from here. Good thing it's been a walk in the park until now. First, find the detector. This is a mobile lab. The scientists ought to have at least one. I got it. I've already got a detector. You'll need to acquire an artifact to shield yourself from the scanner's radiation. If you don't, you might end up joining the Gola. How? Find an anomaly. After the emission, it shouldn't be that difficult. Then use the detector's signal to navigate it. If the stalkers have figured it out, I'm sure you can too. After that, attach the artifact to your belt and go plant the scanner. Just try not to get killed in the anomaly. That would be rather embarrassing. Okay, so we got to go. Next question is to find an anomaly field somewhere out that way. But I think we're going to do that on the next episode. This is a good start. Get our feet wet. Learn some maneuvers. We haven't got into any major combat yet, but I'm sure that's coming. So with that, give me a like if you enjoyed this episode. Give me a subscribe if you're new to the channel. And we'll see you on the next one.